All right, y'all, I'm back here and I'm gonna give you one more video before I head out tomorrow, y'all. I'm staying dedicated to y'all, man. I'm still staying dedicated to the build and I'm trying to do as much as I can um, and the least amount of time that I can. So I actually um, have been wanting to put the seat in and kind of see what it looks like inside. I'm gonna flip this camera around and show you what it looks like. So again, this is the 05 GTO seats um, that I'm gonna swap it to the 71 Chevelle I'm gonna flip this camera around. The the, um, the seat is a little dis or dismangled right now because I got the back cushion off, but I'm trying to lighten it up so I can move it out around a little bit easier. But let me flip this camera around so you guys can see it. So this is what it looks like inside. Hopefully you guys can kind of tell uh, from here. Let's see if I can get better lighting. I don't know. Um, that's probably a little bit better right there. So uh, it's in there. It's seated in there and uh yeah i think it looks pretty good y'all i think it looks pretty dang good so um i have the original bolt uh or i bought them from ebay uh, but these are the original bolts or the size bolts that go on this car uh, this is the original hole for the bench seat because this car was originally a bench seat so it's a hole here and a hole right down there but i got a bolt in it and as you can see these brackets are a little bit longer uh, for the gto um in my reading and research they did say that they sat a little bit high um and I kind of already knew that, but again, I'm only 5'10", so um, I'm good with that. I, I have it lowered all the way down, the seat, the uh, power seats. I have them put it all the way down, and they're still a little tall. Um, I'm probably maybe a couple inches from the ceiling as far as, like, because these are um, like drop ceilings or hanging ceilings, so this is where the material would stop where this rod is. And when I'm inside, I'm probably like a couple inches below that. So I have some headroom, but they are a little tall. The only remedy, or the only way that I could probably fix that is, as you can see, these brackets here uh, come to like a almost a 90 degree bend, if you guys can kind of see that. I have towels there so I don't scratch the floor. But the only thing I can really do possibly is if you can see that mounting hole there i was going to put a bracket behind it and then make a bend and then put a hole down here so it could bolt to the floor um the only thing i could really do is maybe take off um uh, either a, a you know a half an inch to a three quarters of an inch here to kind of lower the seat down a little bit more or i could totally chop this off this piece off and possibly weld a piece to the side to kind of sit it lower um i don't know if i want to do that what i might do is just play it safe and just leave it as is and then once i get the car running and everything uh just kind of just see what it is from there then i can always adjust the seats later um because if the car is running i can always take the seat out if needed um the seat will probably set a little bit higher um, probably be when the carpet is in but uh, we'll see but I wanted to give you guys a visual kind of what it looked like so what I'm gonna have to do is bolt it to the floor here on this side what I'm probably gonna do is get some rev nuts and put those in there but let me go ahead and sit inside it so you guys can kind of get more of a view of what it looks like sorry it is so dark in here but um, I got the, the console just kind of just temporarily mocked up so you guys can kind of get a visual and so I can get a visual of what everything is like. But um, yeah, I have it all the way back. I wouldn't be necessarily sitting this far back because uh, the pedal's right, you know, I'd have to get the pedal down further to the floor in order to drive it. But um, all in all, it's pretty good. The steering wheel is not directly uh, center is probably off to the left a little bit from where the seat is mounted over probably about mm, maybe about an inch two at the most but probably about an inch over to the left I don't know if that's really gonna bug me or not um, 
Honestly, I haven't really even noticed in my cars if I'm pretty much centered in the center. Um, I don't know, we'll see. I'll kind of have to just get a good feel for it. If not, then I'll have to make some adjustments here. But there's not much room on the floor that I can move the seat over. So um, I might just have to kind of deal with it and kind of just go from there. But anyways, um, it's looking pretty good in here, y'all. Let, uh, let me flip this camera back around or get you a better angle so you guys can see a little bit more. But yeah, yeah, I gotta make this quick because my battery's about to die, but uh, she is in there. I mean, for the most part, I'm pretty excited about that. That looks pretty damn good. Um, so yeah, I mean, I could probably move the seat over just a little bit, but as you can see right here, I don't have much room. Um, so I don't even know if it's worth doing because this is probably only like a quarter to like maybe three eighths of an inch I could move it over here and I could possibly move it over a little bit here but that's not much room so I don't even know if it's if it's worth it uh, or not so I don't know we'll see I'll kind of see how it goes but anyways uh, she is in there so I wanted to give you guys a visual of what that looks like inside mocked up and uh, man it's all coming together it's slow but it's all coming together. So yeah, y'all yeah, stay tuned for more. 60 LSX 71 Chevelle build coming at you. All right, I'm out tomorrow. I'm heading to Mexico and I am gonna film a video in Mexico and I'm not gonna say what it is just yet. It's gonna be a surprise for everybody out there, all the subscribers. Just know it's an appreciation um, uh, video and it's coming while I'm in Mexico. So anyways, I'll holla, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff, y'all. I appreciate everybody out there. Deuces, and I'm out.